what's up you guys it's your girl Apollonia Cross and today we are putting away our fall decorations and setting up for Christmas I'm excited I already got the Christmas music in the background as you guys can already maybe hear and we already took some of them who's that that's Bobby Joe or Bobby Ray I don't remember what my niece like named him but so this is Steve no, Aquila named that one, but that's not Aquila. So that's like Bob Joe, and then this one is Steve. So they're going away, and as you can see, we got some Christmas decorations to set up. So if you guys are wanting to do that with us, then stay tuned. Girls, put the ornaments back. No. No. So thankfully, these ornaments that the girls are messing with, these are like giveaway ornaments. I'm going to see if my sister-in-law might want them. Otherwise, I might try to give them to somewhere else. But sometimes, you can't beat them, join them. That's like my motto when it comes to trying to get stuff done. Especially with little, so don't beat yourself up if things get a little crazy and you're trying not to lose your sh okay? Raya, pick up the pumpkin and put it away. Put it away, baby. Put it inside. Yep. Yay! Clap, clap. Yay! Okay, so as you guys can kind of tell, it is kind of like we got boxes and all kinds of stuff like all over the place. But that's like one of the biggest things though is to make sure that you do have good storage. Now, I'm not going to go into detail about that in this video, but making sure you have things labeled and however you like to decorate your house, if you want to do it by season, by color, or whatever you want to do, making sure you have good labels so that way when it's time to go ahead and change things out, like for example, my stuff is labeled fall decor, fall decor, spring decor, Christmas decor, summer decor. So all of these have their own individual boxes so that way whenever I'm going to change out the season, I pull out that particular season box that I'm going to be decorating or boxes. Like Christmas is definitely more than one box. But like I pull that out, those out and that's what I'm using and then I pull out the decoration box that I'm going to be putting away and those go into that box. So that way there's no confusion about what goes where, how it's gonna get stored and it's just very easy pull out and put away. So like as you can see, these are our summer boxes. Whoop, there we go. So the summer and spring, like kind of small. Um, and then our fall, cause I love fall, but I got a very big storage. I got our hay in here and pumpkins. And so these I use, most of my decorations I do use year round cause I pick a theme for our decor and then I just kind of add on as the years kind of go by, it just depends. So like I said, I'm not gonna go too much more into detail on organizing your decorations and how to get started with that and all of that jazz. Not in this video, I'll do a completely separate video if you guys let me know that that's something you want to, me to do. If that's something that you wanna get into is decorating the house because I love decorating the house inside and out because it just helps kind of create a good vibe and relaxing and then it just, again, it just creates a good vibe and it kind of can help you set the tone, especially when you're not feeling that great. And then when you wake up and you see, you know, when your house is clean, uh, when your house is clean and the decorations are all pretty and nice, it just helps you get into the vibe to embracing the season and the time of year that it is. So like I said, not going to go any further than that, but let's go ahead and get finished with pulling all of these decorations down because that's before Christmas stuff goes up, all the fall stuff has to come down. So let's do it.
find a way, a very affordable and convenient way to put your wreaths up without having to buy a container, grab you a hanger, <laughs> find the loop on the back, and the baby's trying to talk to you, but put the hanger through the loop and there you go. Yeah. Now you can just hang it in your closet without, Yeah. and it's just fine. Just and move it out the way, and there you go. <laughs> Thought you guys might like and that. Me. It's obviously like I'm sure you got hangers. Hey, you can. <laughs>
am going to need quite a bit of help with this, so I think I'm just going to save it for our big family project, aside from the very little things to do. And then I'll do a whole another separate video on how the entire house came out to look completely decorated. So thank you guys so much for hanging out with me in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.